And it's not okay to think that the Earth is flat. This is not a viable argument. Um, I have friends who have been on the International Space Station. They have orbited the Earth once every 90 minutes. You know, I have had personal experience with people that have been up in space and can see with their own eyes that the Earth is round. And of course, we've taken all these amazing pictures from space. <laughs> Freemason. This is not a viable argument. It's difficult to know where to start. You know, what they're selling is this. You came from nothing. You are nothing. Because there are proofs all around you. It is not difficult to know that the Earth is round. In fact, people have known this for way more than 2,000 years. The ancient Greeks actually had a number of really elegant, wonderful proofs that the Earth was a sphere. Disinformation campaigns. But I will tell you, all across the flat earth. Over the horizon that's curved. In fact, all independent research of sending balloon satellites up into the sky show what? Flat horizon. So we're, we're the one thing that is different? No, and, and that actually that actually made somebody who was who was more interested in actually hearing information. That actually got them to think. They're like, "You're right." You know, you know, everything else we take a picture of is a sphere. Now, sink into the floor. Wait, 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 wait. Sink. All our space information since 1958, that's what, when the NASA was formed in 1958, all our inf and then it was formed by Nazis. Werner von Braun, the director of all six fake moon missions, was one of Hitler's right-hand men. He was a fucking rocket scientist for Hitler, who was evil as fuck. He directed six moon missions, masters of propaganda. And when he died, he was like, he, he was on some deathbed confessional type shit. He told his assistant, he said, on his deathbed, according to her, he said, the fake alien invasion is coming. Mm. Like, the fake alien invasion is what they've been planning. That's what's gonna scare everybody into a one world government. It's always been about a one world government and the fake alien invasion, that'll get everybody together. Everybody will volunteer. So we gotta, you know, the aliens are gonna kill us. We gotta all unite. Yeah. So that's been the plan, the fake, and that's what Warner von Braun said. And on his tombstone, on his tombstone, it has a, a, a Psalm, whatever, like Psalm eight. I don't know, like the Bible verses, verses, but it's a particular Psalm in the Bible mm -hmm. that talks about the firmament. However, let us imagine for a moment that the many problems have been solved, and that after completing our space station, we are ready to begin our first voyage around the moon. The firmament, which is what, what people believe that like, around there's a, there's us, a dome, around there's us, a yeah. dome firmament. We're in an enclosed system. Mm -hmm. We're in a special place. Why the fuck would he have that on his tombstone? It's you look like you're in a studio, maybe in Omaha, Nebraska or something. The, the, the shot is so clear. Is this a hoax? Are you really in space still? I don't know. We're going to have to do something for you. shooting through space at a million miles an hour? No. Does it feel like we're going a million miles an hour? And it's not just a million. According to mainstream um, astrophysics, we're going... Uh, A 
miles an hour on our we're spinning a thousand miles an hour on our own axis and then we're shooting around the sun at yeah. 60,000 miles an hour 60,000 miles and then the sun is shooting around the center of the Milky Way at 600,000 miles an hour And the Milky Way galaxy itself is shooting through the universe at <laughs> one million. That's what they wrote. That's what they wrote. People are hypnotized. That's what's going on. People, there, there's mass hypnosis going on. People are hypnotized. That's what's going on. People, there, there's mass hypnosis going on. People are hypnotized. That's what's going on. People, there, there's mass hypnosis going on. There's never been any proof that we're moving. Or do you think a there's big, a glitch in the system? No, there's a big movement trying to stomp out like flat earth theory. Any conspiracy theory that uh, is out there, say like 9 11, right? 9 mm 11 -hmm. uh, for sure is an inside job. There's no doubt. If you look into it, it's no doubt. No doubt. That's an inside fucking job if you actually look into it. Right. So. People are hypnotized. That's what's going on. People, there, there's mass hypnosis going on. We don't have the technology to do that anymore. We uh, destroyed that technology, and it's been a painful process to put it back together. That's worth a lot. I got that shit. Done. That's crazy. And we destroyed the technology. Destroy the technology? Oh, like flat Earth, you go flat Earth, you go to YouTube, you're gonna get nothing but debunking videos. Right. Why are they making videos debunking flat Earth? It's so stupid. <laughs> Why are there people making videos and spending a lot of time, full time jobs debunking what we are living on? Why are they doing that? How does flat Earth have such legs? How, how does it have legs? It's so dumb. Right. How is it? How is it just? It just keeps growing and growing. People are waking the fuck up. 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 is a gun that uses just electricity, no gunpowder, and oh, by the way, can shoot a projectile like this, well over 100 miles at Mach 7. Seven times the speed of sound. 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 Well over 100 miles at Mach 7. Seven times the speed of sound. Seven times the speed of sound. Again, I'm not saying that I know everything because I certainly don't. I'm asking you to critically think. I'm asking you to think for yourself. Is the world a sphere? Is it a globe? Do you feel like you're moving on this planet? Because I don't. It seems pretty stationary. When I look at the horizon, it looks flat. In fact, they actually thought the world was flat for thousands of years before they came up with the theory that it was a sphere. 
So maybe it is flat. Maybe it isn't. Maybe this truly is the Truman Show. And we all live in a dome. Many ancient civilizations thought just that. And not only did these same ancient civilizations sacrifice thousands and millions of children to the gods, it's still being done here in the United States of America under the authority of secret societies that really rule the world. So we live in this world where the AI is taking over, and I'm just telling you to look into this stuff, folks. I'm not telling you to believe me. I'm not telling you to believe NASA. I'm telling you to critically think. How much in your life of your current reality do you just take for granted? Well, I don't know. I don't understand that math paradigm. I don't understand that blueprint or engineering, so I'm just not going to think about it and even try. There's someone else that understands this kind of, kind of thing. It's like the tax code today. It's so complicated that it reaches a certain point where you're like, well, I don't know, hands off. There's professionals that do this kind of thing, right? It's not like the IRS would overcharge me or anything like that. The Earth is flat. End of story. <laughs> <laughs>